Hi guys, it's Jacob from the New England Coupon Character, and I know this lighting is a little bit weird, um, and I'm all sweaty, but um, this is just going to be a casual vlog. I wanted to mostly talk about Big Brother today because there has been a lot that has happened, and I wanted to talk about it all because I know there are a few of you that watch Big Brother, uh, and I am a Big Brother fanatic. Um, I'm catching up right now. I'm watching Big Brother 8, I believe, on YouTube with Evil Dick. Um, I'm loving it so far. That's all I have to say. So, this video, though, was mainly to talk about uh, Season 18 so far. And um, I just went couponing as well at a few stores. I will be posting that video probably tomorrow. So, you know, Tuesday is probably going to be the day mostly that I'll be posting. Um... I, I did that the past two weeks and probably for the next two weeks it's you know hard for me to get into a schedule because my schedule is always changing but you know it's good to have a little bit of a schedule um, for at least the month of August and yeah so Big Brother 18 there was a major power shift and I'm sorry I keep moving you around there was a major power shift and I could not be any happier I was Jumping up and down, yelling and screaming, and clapping my hands. You would have thought America won all of the gold medals in the Olympics. Now, I watch the Olympics a little bit. I'm not a huge fan of the Olympics. Big Brother is my Olympics. Big Brother is my NFL football. I was super upset almost. Because Thursday night, they had the double eviction. And football was on stupid football. Uh, but I went on channel, like, I forget, my TV 38 or whatever it's called, they had it on there, so I was like, thank the Lord, because if I was going to miss Double Eviction Night Live, that was not happening, and um, I know with like the CBS All Access stuff, but you have to pay for that, and then you get, you get your seven weeks free, but uh, season 19, though, we can talk about that a little bit later, it's going to be on um, CBS All Access, so that will be interesting. So, again, that was a power shift. Basically, Natalie and Bridget flipped the house. So, Polly is now sort of almost on the outs. Polly was the major power player, was in the middle. He was making all of the decisions, and, you know, he was the bros, the executives. And he was wanting to get Michelle out. He was trying to play the, the Cody-Derek game, but, you know, he's a jerk. And we saw that, and we already saw that the past couple of weeks, but, like, the, the show, they, they didn't show it, like, as bad with the whole Zakia thing. Now, they finally showed, like, a, a little bit of, you know, what happened. And I don't watch the live feeds, but I do watch um, Big Brother updates and spoilers, and I read them online and watch videos here on YouTube. And, okay, so, I am super happy. Again, I was jumping up and down. Now let's talk double eviction, and I think this is hilarious. I watch Rob has a podcast. I'm actually I didn't watch all of his um one with Derek, which he just posted the other day. I will be going back. I will be watching that after I post this video. But where was I? I'm 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 rambling on and on and on. Uh, double eviction. Zakia was voted out three to two. James used this thing. I think the TV show. They showed that, you know, Bridget was sort of the one who you know, kind of flipped it or was just had this thought, kind of like, hmm, I don't know. And for the whole time, I was thinking, Bridget is a floater. She was under, you know, Frank's, well, first she was part of the Spy Girls, and she was like, girl, bar, bar. I, I thought I was watching the Powerpuffs, seriously. And then she was under Frank, right? And then she was sort of drifting towards Polly, I thought at least, or maybe towards Paul. I don't know, PP. <laughs> PP pee -pee is broken. PP pee -pee is done. And I'm happy with that. I'm tired of the PP. -pee -pee. Or it was funny. Julie Chen is like P. P. Or P. And P. And then the announcer's just like P. P. And it, it was just. I, I was getting to me. It was too much at one point. I'm happy they're done. Paul made a good move. i starting to like Paul. I did not like Paul the whole month of July. This month, August, Paul is starting to grow on me. And now we are getting to a point where the, hopefully, I doubt it, but maybe there's going to be an All-Stars in season 19 or 20. And I'm thinking Paul is definitely going to be on there. He has the most um, 
all-star, I think, uh, p potential or recognition, at least, out of this season's cast. And I'm hoping... I like Zach. Um, Fruit Loop Dingus, Nicole. I, I liked uh, Zach. But I think Paul might take his place because he's lost a little bit of um, relevancy. I think that's a word. Because if they had an All-Stars this season, which there were rumors about, he would definitely be on it. Um, but, he, you know, since Paul, he's more current, he would probably be on the All-Stars. And, again, so, Zakia was evicted. They didn't really show... Excuse me. They didn't really show the fact that Natalie and Bridget, they had to push, 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 you know, for James. You know, they had to flip James. And then, you know, James, I think this was a good move on his behalf. But as a fan, he, you know, blew the blind side. He, he told them that Zakia, he was going to vote Zakia. And that's why Nicole was like, I know she's staying, but I can't even. I know she's staying, but I vote to even. I know she. I can't even do it. I, I shouldn't make fun of people. But, you know, everyone else does. So it's okay. And I'm not, I was a fan of Nicole in BB-16. I am not a fan of Nicole this season. I don't know how many times I have to say that. And I think, was it Natalie who pointed out? The only, she, you know, she's all buddy-buddy with uh, Corey. And then, you know, once nominations come around, that's the only time she, you know, breaks away from Polly for a little while and she... Tries to make sure that she doesn't get nominated. She did win the super safety. Alright, I voted for Michelle. I'm thinking, and I'm hoping, I'm 90% sure, Michelle will get, maybe Paul, who knows, the co-HOH. I'm hoping Michelle gets co-HOH. I'm going to cross my fingers. Unless she wins HOH. What, what happens if she wins HOH? What what Big Brother gonna do? Are they still gonna have the twist? The twist just thrown out the window. No say, no say. But um, Bridget was evicted next. That was a bad move on Polly's behalf. He should have got Michelle out honestly, because I think Bridget was sort of a waste. Because Michelle, the one who is who out loud verbally attacked him, and Bridget just like. Yeah, okay, Polly. Okay, Polly. And I'm glad Natalie and Bridget finally came out of the closet. It was just like, where have you been? Where have you been the past two months when we saw Tiffany, uh, Frank, and Devon go after each other that triangle? We needed some other people to be in there so it wasn't just the Bermuda Triangle. So there wasn't just one earthquake. We needed multiple earthquakes. So that way it wouldn't have just been them plucked one after the other. That being said, there is a special episode on Friday. And if the round trip ticket, this is a big if, isn't used, um, but that's a 5 out of 12 chance, so what's that? Let me do the math. It's less than 50%. 5 divided by 12. I don't know. I, it's getting late to do math. Um... <laughs> I know, I'm not in the mood. But, you know, it's a 5 out of 12 chance. Uh, 4 have already been revealed, so, you know, what is it now? It's like 1 out of 8, I think. So 12.5% chance that it will be revealed. I, d I don't know if that's the correct math. I don't know. If you are an arithmetic, let me know if I'm right or wrong. Is it 12.5%? But then, this is all probability, and because four have already been opened up, I don't know. But, if there's the slim chance that the person comes back in, I will be furious, because it's either going to be Corey, it's going to be Polly. Do you know how long I have been waiting for this? I have been waiting almost my whole summer for this to happen. And it's finally happened. Happening. And I don't know, my grandmother likes Corey. I don't know why my grandmother likes Corey. Corey's a Trump supporter. I find Corey annoying. It's just Corey and uh, Nicole, buddy, buddy. Corey, he basically, he, he's Polly's minion, literally. 
uh, I think Bridget would say that, or, uh, no. Tiffany said Bridget was the Cabbage Patch. I don't know, I'm getting confused. And I'm over ten minutes, and I'm rambling on and on. But I'm just happy that they're up on the block, and I'm hoping that they go home! Oh, if they don't, I will cry. Now there's potential on Friday for a jury buyback, if the round trip ticket isn't used. And that's a little bit much, but imagine Davon coming back in the house! Woo! That would be amazing. Now, Polly came back in. I would cry river. Now, spoiler, 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 spoiler. Victor did win the veto, so I'm hoping he keeps nominations the same. Polly goes home. If there, hopefully, he doesn't have the round trip ticket. If there is a jury buyback, I have a feeling though, Devon would be sent right back out of the door. Because of the situation things are right now. Unless Natalie scoops her up. And I'm sorry for keep doing this. I know it's annoying. The lighting keeps changing. And I know that's annoying. Um, where was I going? I'm off track. I'm rambling. I don't have any notes or anything. I'm just like rambling on about Big Brother. I know. I sound like a crazy person. Uh, again, I'll post my haul later. So, you know. Well, I coupon. I guess I'm a crazy person. So... Yeah, that's it. Now, Big Brother 19, there's going to be a fall season, apparently, on CBS All Access. We don't have that information yet. And Zingbot, I just remembered this, Zingbot on Wednesday! I sound like a dolphin. But, or, no, a pelican, a seal? I don't know what animal, but it was just a weird animal noise. I know, I can't think of the animal. Uh, Zingbot. Everybody loves a little bit of zing, if you know what I'm saying. And I'm super excited for that. So, I think that was it. Hoping for an all-star season sometime. I want to see Vanessa play again. Like, with new people, not Austin and the Oz twins. With new people. Because that would be interesting. And imagine if Tiffany and Vanessa were on the same season. Tiffany, Vanessa... Cody and Polly, like they were on the same season, or Rachel and Alyssa. I don't Rachel's gonna ever come back, but you know it would be cool to see Alyssa back on there. I would like to see Alyssa back on there. You know who I would love to see on Big Brother All Star is Helen. And I know season fifteen is all controversial, and their CBS is trying to like make people forget about that. But I like season fifteen because of the drama, and I want to. I definitely want to see like. A McCray and Amanda. You're either going to have McCray or Amanda. I, w I would rather see Amanda. I want Amanda. I want Helen. I it would prob. I, li I like Jesse, actually. Uh, can't I actually like the whole cast, honestly. The whole cast of that season was great. But if I had to pick Helen, Amanda, Spencer, and Jesse, probably. That's who I would want to see on a new season. So yeah, rambling on about Big Brother. I don't know what the title is. Rambling on about Big Brother? I, I don't know, guys. And hopefully you can hear me. Hopefully I'm talking loud enough. You guys are pretty close. Sorry again for moving around so much. My haul, my call, I went to several different stores. You'll see it. We'll be posted tomorrow. Promise that. So yeah. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And I know this was a ramble on video. If you don't watch Big Brother, you probably have no idea what I'm talking about. Research Big Brother. Start watching Big Brother. It's awesome. My favorite show ever. And my mom was like, I'm going to cut the cable next week. You people, you know, yell at the TV. Yell about the TV. And, and I'm sorry. I probably shouldn't have said that. That was probably offensive. So if, if she's watching this, if, so, if someone I know is watching this, I, that was not offensive to my mom. But I don't even know where that came from. I was just saying that. Anyways, I'm rambling on again, again, and again, and again. But I, I can still watch it. Well, she's like, well, you know, no computer either. But I will figure out a way to watch Big Brother, you know, somehow. But thank you for watching. Crazy for Big Brother. I, I will see you all in the next one. Thank you for watching. Bye. <laughs> Big Brother 18. Big Brother 18. Bye.